Best Camping Tents of 2023. We break down the greatest camping tents of the year, from luxury to inexpensive, for your home away from home in the great outdoors. Camping tents are designed for a comparatively opulent experience in the great outdoors since they are roomy, convenient, and feature rich for card games on a wet day. Many of these behemoths have enough space to put up cots or even chairs in a table. Even the cheapest tents on this list should be adequate for vehicle campers who go on a few trips over the summer each year. Better materials and internal room are worth the extra cost for harsher weather conditions or more regular use. We analyze the top camping tents of 2023 in this video. When it comes to camping gear, the North Face might be hit or miss, but their wall line is a hit. The most significant change was to a hybrid double wall construction relatively recently. The previous generation had a less breathable single wall build, and they also redesigned the pole structure to facilitate setup. The tunnel-like form is similar to Ray's Wonderland 6 Below and is available in four and six person capacities for around $100 less. It offers a significant amount of interior room, including about three more square feet of floor surface and an additional two inches of peak height. We also adore the enormous front vestibule's 44.7 square feet, which can easily serve as a seating area. With the Wonderland, you'll need to purchase the Mudroom add-on $125 separately to attain the same adaptability. All things considered, the Walla is an incredibly livable design and a fantastic value. The Base Camp 6 occupies a prominent position in Ray's camping range for 2023 and draws inspiration from mountaineering designs for a significant improvement in weatherworthiness. The walls aren't as vertical as the Wawin is above due to the dome shape and overlapping five-pole system, but it's still extremely simple to move around within and the benefit is far higher resistance against severe gusts. The tent is rated for three plus season use, so it can hold its own. The rest of the design is also top notch with a great combination of high quality materials and design elements like two roof vents, practical organization, and even reflective trim to make the tent easier to see at night. Coleman is nearly synonymous with low cost camping equipment so it should come as no surprise that their Skydome 6 is our top pick for under $100 this year. But what surprises us is how contemporary this tent feels and looks. The Skydome is significantly more weather-worthy. With a full coverage rainfly, the Sun Domes leaves most of the sides exposed and uses pre-bent poles and more vertical walls that open up the inside in a significant degree compared to Coleman's somewhat outdated and cheap-feeling Sun Dome below. Additionally, we adore the pre-attached poles that make assembly a snap. Additionally, the broad door and amply spacious vestibule greatly enhance convenience. The majority of the tents on our list are solely designed for car camping, which means that you won't be transporting them more than a few feet from your car. However, if you want to travel into the back country, there are a few crossover alternatives that can serve two purposes. Consider Marmot's Tungsten 4P as an example. The Tungsten can fit many sleeping pads side by side for automobile camping and has a peak height of 52 inches, which is plenty for sitting up, getting dressed, or playing cards. Additionally, the pole design nicely stretches the walls to be almost vertical at the bottom, giving the space a feeling of relative openness. The tungsten isn't light, it weighs just over 9 pounds, but it's more than adequate for camping and short hiking trips, especially if you can split up the carrying duties. We regret that weight recently increased by a significant 12.8 ounces. A few years back, the Aurora series from New Hampshire-based Nemo was unveiled, giving crossover alternatives like the Marmot Tungsten Buff and REI Trail Hut below arrival. With a standing height interior, steep sidewalls, and a sizable footprint that challenged the liability of rivals like the highest rated Wona and REI Wonderland below, the most recent high-rise variant, on the other hand, shoots for the premium and opulent tent of the market. As we've come to expect from Nemo, 
The Aurora high-rise is also thoughtfully constructed with windows at each side that make it simple to air things out and remain dry when open. Two sizable doors and vestibules, a rain fly that can be staked out as an awning pole sold separately, and high-quality materials throughout including sturdy aluminum poles and a thick 150 denier floor that's decorated with a playful checkered pattern. The Walna 6 from the North Face, which replaces the wildly popular Kingdom, strikes a better balance between price and space, while Ray's Wonder and 6 outperforms it in terms of features. Similar to the Kingdom, this opulent tent is distinguished by nearly vertical walls, plenty of mesh for ventilation and stargazing including strategically placed triangle windows, and a tunnel-like design that provides excellent liveability. The six-person variant is great for families and bigger groups. There is plenty of space to sprawl out and stand up. Color-coded parts make setup quick and simple, and a center divider lets you segregate sleeping from non-sleeping regions. Although the Wonderland costs $599, a note worth $100 more than the Kingdom 6, it is less expensive than rivals like Chemsr's Habitude and the six-person version of Nemo's Wagon Top Below, without sacrificing the quality or longevity of the materials. Many of the tents on this list cost significantly more than $300, but the cost-conscious Kelty consistently seems to perform a good job of balancing quality and affordability. The wireless is a prime example. It costs $300 for the six-person version and offers a number of improvements over less expensive tents like the Coleman Skydome above and the Sundome below. You also receive a full coverage rainfly for wet and windy weather. The Sundomes covers just the top, two entrances, and two vestibules. Both Colemans only have one. Additionally, Kelty makes use of extra mesh throughout manufacturing which makes it simpler to stay cool during the summer. You get one heck of a deal if you add a moderately spacious interior with a center ridge pole that stretches the walls up and away. Remember, both Coleman's lack this. Although the TNF Wonga and REI Wonderland are difficult to surpass for liveability, Marmot has another excellent setting in the limestone. With enough room for six people to sleep comfortably, or four if you like to spread out, this camping tent is simple to set up and has fair weather resistance thanks to a full coverage rain fly and taut deck pole construction. The marmots poles also successfully stretch the walls outward to give the impression that the interior is even larger than it already is. In addition to its tall 76-inch peak height, the Wauna and Wonderland are 80 and 78 in, respectively. Although the limestone costs $500, it is still less expensive than the Wonderland and performs better when the wind picks up. The Trail Hut 4 from Marii is the third model to make our list and competes directly with Marmot's Tungsten 4P as a crossover car camping and backpacking alternative. When compared to the Tungsten, the Trail Hut weighs just over one pound less, has 2.3 square feet more floor space, and costs more than $100 less. The raised pole construction is fairly simple and doesn't do much to stretch the walls up and away, while the Marmot has a 4-inch higher peak height and a more open form that increase its attractiveness for families. However, the Trail Hut is yet another outstanding deal from the Seattle-based company. The Big Agnes Big House, which is aptly titled, provides tremendous internal room at a reasonable cost. The Big House competes against high-end models like the REI Wonderland 6, Marmot Limestone 6B, and the North Face Wona 6 above with 83 square feet of floor space and a host of high-end features like ample storage, a front door mat for storing dirty shoes, and a handy shelter mode for providing shade on hot days. The side walls of the big house slope aggressively upward to a peak height of 81 inches in the six-person size, making the structure strikingly tall. Remember that the success space can act like a sail in the wind, so stake the tent out thoroughly and use the provided guidelines to prevent this from happening. For 2022, Ari, I added the Skyward to their line of camping tents in favor of the well-liked Grand Hut. 
which had previously topped our rankings. Importantly, they drew inspiration from the Grand Hut's design, which had a peak height of 78 inches, a standing height interior, a relatively lightweight, almost vertical walls that maximized space, and a freestanding structure that was simple to pitch. With the same thick materials along the floor 150D and fly 75D and a sizable 83 square foot footprint, the Grand Hut 6 had 83.3 SQFD. Floor size and durability also compare favorably. Overall, it's yet another well-constructed and incredibly livable option from our favorite outdoor cooperative. The Wagon Top 4P from Nemo is the second alternative from their collection to make our list this year. They consistently release well thought out and innovative tent designs. With a standing height ceiling at the entry, this innovative design outperforms dome-shaped tents in terms of headroom, a hub pole structure with nearly vertical walls, and an optional garage attachment for even more storage. This tent has outstanding inside space. You can make a fun and feature-rich camping tent by adding colorful panoramic windows and accessories like a victory blanket available separately that are the same size as the floor of the tent. The interior of Ray's Wonderland, which is shown above, is notable for being very livable and well ventilated, and the Wonderland X elevates that concept by adding adjustable areas for sleeping, cooking, and socializing. Basically, it's two tents in one. The clip-in inner tent provides space for up to four adults to sleep comfortably, while the rainfly can be set up independently as a shade structure or camp kitchen. There are two huge doors that are large enough to fit a regular wagon or SUV underneath, and four side panels along the fly that can be rolled up for more airflow or staked out as awnings poles supplied separately. REI has put a lot of consideration into the opulent build. The tent is moderately weather-ready with a silicone-treated DWR finish and coatings throughout the fly to fend against mildew and fading from UV radiation. Storage is also abundant, with plenty of compartments for stashing necessities. When considered as a whole, the Wonderland X is the pinnacle of glamping and leaves avid car campers with little to be desired. Thanks for watching. For your convenience, you can click on the links in the description below and view all details on our recommended products 